Hello everyone. We are beginning with uh, the schedule of the Foreign Ministry on the 14th and 15th of November. Upon the invitation of the Foreign Minister of the Russian Federation, our country will be visited by the Foreign Ministry of the uh, Dominican Republic, Ecuador, Commonwealth of Dominica, the Deputy Foreign Minister of El Salvador, as well as a Special Representative of the Government of Nicaragua. On the 14th of November in Sochi, a ministerial meeting of Russia in the extended community of the Latin American Global State will be held. We attach great importance to cooperation with uh, this organization, CELOC, as it's an authoritative organization and integration agency of the region. We have similar approaches as regards the fair world order based on uh, the rule of law, international law, the guiding role of the United Nations in the Possibility of any attempts to interfere with internal affairs of sovereign states. In the modern globalized world, we are approaching several tasks. A joint declaration or a roadmap will be passed upon the conclusion of the meeting. This day, uh, in Sochi, there will be bilateral meeting of Sergei Lavrov with the Ministry of the Dominican Republic, the Commonwealth of Dominica, and Ecuador. In order to strengthen strategic partnership with Ecuador, joint declaration of ministers will be signed on not non-placement of weapons in space. On the uh, 17th, 19th November, there will be uh, the meeting of ministers of economy and trade in Lima, which will be the last stage, the last, last preparatory stage of APEC. Plans for uh, 19th and 20th of November. This meeting will address the priority areas of cooperation within APEC for uh, 2017, aiding SMEs and assessing development of food markets. We're also going to discuss the further cooperation. Russia is going to take an active part in discussions and uh, the agenda will be aimed at cooperation in the region. We believe it's important to concentrate on countering terrorism in order to uh, foster the economic development in the Asia Pacific. The joint declaration of ministers and uh, the final declaration of leaders are going to be passed. Let's now get to other issues. I'd like to say that this year Russia and Mongolia are celebrating an important date in their relations. Of, in, as regards uh, good neighborliness, partnership, constructive cooperation. We're speaking about 95, 95th anniversary of diplomatic relations between our countries on the 5th of November 1921. The agreement between Russia and Mongolia on establishing good neighborly relations between the country were signed defines the development of bilateral cooperation of these countries for the upcoming years as regards mutual trust and respect for interests. On the 11th of November, the Russian Ministry of Foreign Affairs is going to host an exhibition of documents and photographs dedicated to this important 
event. There is also the Chronicle of the 1921. It shows uh, the support by Russia to the development of relations between the two countries. The agreement on friendly relations was signed on the uh, 20th of January 1993 and a number of other documents such as the Declaration on Strategic Partnership which was signed in London.